So, okay. I'll, I'll try and uh, give a spontaneous and slightly different, but exactly the same answer in a different way. Fantastic. I okay. don't know if I'll be able to achieve that or not. Okay. Ready? Yep. You're yep. asking these questions. I know you're asking these <laughs> questions to find to find out how I felt about the interview mm-hmm. in a in a, a sneaky way on video. You know, after the interview. Okay, you've worked it out. Yeah, I worked that out at the end of the question, the first time you asked them. Okay, go on. <laughs> okay. Ask them again. Uh, Mick, what was your reaction when I first asked you to speak to me for this book? Uh, I had a go. I felt... Uh, <laughs> I'm trying to remember my answer. Uh, I felt it sounded like a worthwhile subject, and um, I was... To, for someone to be investigating or doing interviews about or looking into. Mm. So I felt that it was, uh, that uh, if I could find the time, that uh, it it'd be, might, be, might be a worthwhile thing to do. Mm-hmm. So I just kept up the dialogue, I guess, and then waited to see if it uh, came together. Mm-hmm. Why did you say yes? Could have easily said no. Um... Uh, because I, I don't mind saying yes to stuff. I don't mind kind of talking to people about issues that are might be interesting or worthwhile. So, I mean, saying no requires um, uh, actually saying no and blocking something off is a a sort of you know you have to feel quite. I, I have to feel quite strongly about that. I mean, some it could be a practical reason that I just don't feel that I'm available, mm. like literally. I'm, not actually available for some period of time for some reason that would be one reason but outside of that if there's the potential for me to have some availability then I'd have to really not like the subject that they wanted to talk to me about Mm -hmm. which in this case I didn't dislike it so I've no idea whether you you know you're going to write a pamphlet or um or uh uh, or you're actually just pretending you're writing a book, but then you never do do that, do you? You just have to trust people on on face value, and it, mm-hmm. all, it all seems fairly reasonable to me. That's right. Okay. Finally, are you glad you said yes? Uh, so far, so far, I'm fine about having said yes. Yes. The the interview seemed to be uh, interesting enough, and. Um, uh, I haven't seen any any evidence of the material being misused yet. <laughs> <laughs> that sounds like a threat. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, it's just the reality. So, okay, cool. Okay, thanks. Right, thanks. Thank you. Thank you. Cheers. Bye.